This is Saturday morning and uh, you can see the uh, dock is still underwater but not as, as much under as it was yesterday. Some of the dock's uh, deck is, is above water now. But I'll let you see if you can see how <coughs> fast this water is rushing. It's unbelievable this time of year to have this much water in the river. Both the chutes at the dam seem to be wide open. I don't know this morning, I haven't been there yet. This is a good old fire pit. It cooked what, $100 worth of ribs last weekend and $70 worth of chicken. And we also had a turkey, so we, we weren't really hungry last week with all those kids. This is some of the wood that the guys cut up last time they were here. And uh, this is one pile. We have a, here's another view of the same wood pile. You can see there are three stacks of wood here which is going to make a nice fire for the summer for us. This is another stack of wood that the kids cut. They really worked hard that few hours they worked. Here's a shot of the garage. I don't think I have a moving picture of the garage. Actually, the sun is so bright, I can hardly see the monitor on the camera. But I hope I'm getting a picture of the Donahoe Estate, which we're pretty proud of. This is the cabin itself. And you can see the grass seed that we planted the last time we were here seems to have disappeared. It doesn't look like any of it has grown. Of course, it's pure sand, so I don't know if it will. Attention, mesothelioma lung cancer patients. A free mesothelioma DVD and information packet is now available. This is the view from the sliding doors in the front of the cabin looking over Jeff's balcony and the deck here attached to the building. Maybe you can get another view of how fast this river really is flowing. This is another shot of the deck and uh, you can see the entire deck is underwater. Of course the runways are free. Now this is a shot of Doc's deck and you can see the water is not over that today but it was way over that deck yesterday. This is a shot from the riverside of the building. You can see the addition that we put on and the shed that we've had for several years and a couple of beautiful canoes sitting there behind everything. This is our famous bird sea feeding station. Right now it appears that I better put some food out there or we're going to lose all the birds we had.